near as I know, 1890, uh, great uncle, my grandfather's, my paternal grandfather's brother, had left Poland at a very early age, probably around uh, 17 or 18, had come to this country, landed in New York, and proceeded across the country. So he ran out of country in Seattle here. <laughs> And uh, he uh, established, he was in company with, uh, at the time, the Schaefers and other people, was, became one of the founders of both the Vicar Colum and the Temple de Hirsch. So we're uh, plaque owners, as the Navy calls them, of both, both the Reform and the Orthodox uh, synagogues. Anyhow, he was, uh, he had quite a few clothing stores and outfitters for Alaska and was able to bring his brothers over. Uh, my grandpa, dad's father, had been in the Russian army and uh, I think prior to 1905 they knew that there would be a war with Japan or they anticipated the Tsar would want to do something adventurous. and. Uh, so it was quite necessary, as far as they were concerned, to get out. And Grandpa came over uh, and then uh, worked for his brother. After a time, had enough uh, money saved to send for his wife and, at that time, the three three children. And uh, they, uh, was it three or four, let me just say, one, two, three, four children. Dad was the oldest, Ben Bridge was the oldest. And uh, when uh, Grandma came, she was a very tough, strong-minded woman. Uh, Grandpa was a very pious man, and she ran everything. She was quite a matriarchy. And uh, I think she had selected Dad of all the kids to be the one that was going to be successful and endowed him with a great deal of attention. <laughs>